Police in Northern Ireland have seized cocaine worth over 11.6 million euro close to the border in South Armagh. The drugs were found hidden inside frozen meat in a van which was stopped in the village of Jonesborough. It's the largest ever seizure of cocaine by the PSNI. Senior police officers put the consignment of cocaine on display in Belfast this afternoon. It had been hidden in a large van, stopped by officers on routine patrol in the village of Jonesborough on the South Armagh North Louth border on Monday evening. The crime gang had gone to some care to conceal it from X-ray and sniffer dogs. It was in a lead and concrete lined hide in a consignment of frozen meat. It took a detailed search of the van to turn it up. The sophistication of the concealment method and the sheer quantity of the drugs recovered gives an indication of the, the scale of the criminality involved. The police wouldn't be drawn on whether there was a link to a specific crime gang in the Republic, but said given the area in which it had been seized, they were now working closely with Angar the Siakana. There's been a real drive to normalise the policing service available to the people in South Armagh in recent years, and this find is testament to that. This vehicle was stopped by two community police officers who'd simply become suspicious of it. They weren't to know at that moment that they'd just made the biggest ever seizure of cocaine in Northern Ireland. A man was arrested at the time on suspicion of traffic offences and released on police bail. But this is just the start of a complex investigation. The vehicle was taken to the police station as a result of the arrest. UK Border Force assisted us and conducted an X-ray on the actual containers themselves. That's what helped us to identify that what is a sophisticated hide. When we forced that, that's what we found here. Police are looking for help in tracing the movements of the van in the previous three weeks. Its detection has disrupted a major drugs supply route. Conor McCauley, RT News.